back to my channel. Um, so today I have a haul for you guys. Recently, Chemist Warehouse had their 50% off all big brand cosmetics sale, which is literally my favourite time of the year. <laughs> That's Christmas. I didn't get like a crazy ton of makeup, but I did get quite a few things, so I thought I might show you that. Um, so I did get a couple of skincare products, which obviously were not part of the cosmetic sale. But um, I'll just show you them as well. So I got a couple of Sukin products uh, because these were on sale for like 30% off or something like that. And I did need some new like skincare products and stuff. The first thing I got was this Sukin Calming Night Cream. Rich night cream moisturiser with calming cucumber and chamomile to soothe the complexion. Rosehip Borage and Evening Primrose Oils deliver deep hydration to delicate skin and improve skin elasticity and texture. I do really need like a nice kind of night cream and the reason I picked this up was because my night cream at the moment, I'm using the Simple Night Cream and I feel like it's a bit light. Coming into winter time now, I definitely need something a little bit more heavy duty. So I was hoping that this would be a little bit more moisturising, a little bit more thick on the skin, um, so that I can wake up with really nice moisturised skin. The next product I got from Sukin was this Hydrating Mist Toner. I had no intention to buy a toner, but I don't know, it was on sale and I just, I picked it up and I just read the little label which says This alcohol free skin hydrating mist combines chamomile and rose water to help soothe, tone and cool tired skin Use after cleansing or whenever your skin feels tired or stressed Perfect for hot days, long flights or long days in an air conditioned environment And I don't know, that just like drew me in I thought, you know, this would be kind of nice to just have around just spritz all over my face when I'm getting a little bit, you know, hyped up or even after like flights and everything like that where my skin just goes crazy dry. I'm really excited to use it actually. The last thing I got from Sukin was this facial moisturiser. This daily moisturiser provides fast absorbing deeply penetrating hydration that softens and soothes skin. A lightweight cream which combines a delicate infusion of aloe vera, horsetail, nettle and burdock to soothe and skin with healing rose hip, wheat germ, jojoba and avocado oil to promote healthy skin. Um, I've just been feeling like I've just had crazy dry skin recently. Um, because of the winter and the cold and everything like that. So I wanted to pick up just like a moisturiser I could just chuck on when my skin's feeling a little bit parched. So hopefully that does the trick and just moisturises my skin. By the way, all Sukin products are like cruelty free, Australian owned, 100% vegan, 100% no animal testing and stuff like that. And they have like this little no, 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 no little label on the back which I think is quite cool. So if you're vegan or if you're all for like, no animal testing and stuff like that, this, this would be an awesome brand to check out. I've never actually tried any Sukin products so I'm excited to try these out and hopefully I'll let you know how they go. Time for makeup! Like I said, Chemist Warehouse is having their 50% off big brand cosmetics so I went in and picked up a couple of products the first thing I will show you is this Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Colour and this is in Addiction. This is a new product from the drugstore. This is really gorgeous kind of plummy pink kind of colour. Really nice for the winter time. Oh, I love the smell of these. <laughs> the next thing I got was also new to the drugstore and this is um, the Maybelline New York Color Blur. And this is in... Mm, number 35 Plum Please. These are so intriguing. Down this end they've got like a little kind of rubbery... It's squishy. <laughs> and then down this end they have the actual product, like a twist up kind of thing. Which I actually really like. You're supposed to like draw this in the center of your lip and then blur it out with the little squishy end which um i don't know how that's going to work but it's a really pretty kind of plum color again really nice for the winter time i think you're going to start noticing a theme with all of the lip products i got so heads up next thing i got was this rimmel um clear complexion clarifying powder 
and this is in 021 Transparent. Um, I wanted to go get one of their Stay Matte Powders in a translucent colour, but they didn't have it. So I just picked this one up instead. Really excited to see how it wears. I really like it. It's so like flawless. <laughs> so I'm really excited to try that out. The next thing I got, which I'm so excited about, was this Little London. Um, what is this called? Contour kit, I guess. Oh, it's called a sculpting palette. It comes with a highlighter, a contour sculptor, and a blush colorer. This is in. 002 Coral Glow. It's just, it's so pretty. I'm super excited to try this out. This is one of the things that I was like, I need to get this. So, yes! So I got two um, lip liners. This is a Rimmel Exaggerate lip liner. And this is in 105 Under My Spell. Just this really nice kind of pinky purple kind of colour. And the second one I got was this... Maybelline New York Superstay Lip Liner in 41 Rosewood and this is just a really beautiful kind of mauve everyday kind of colour. I also got two um, concealers. The first concealer I got was from Rimmel and this is just the Rimmel London Wake Me Up Concealer and this is in the shade 010 Ivory. The second one I got which I am super excited about is this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in number 10 light. This was another thing on my list that I just I wanted to get because I've seen so many YouTubers use it and just say it's like amazing. And whenever I go into every chemist warehouse I've been to, every price line I've been to, they never have the light shade. So I went into the chemist warehouse when I went to go buy all this stuff and guess what? It wasn't there. And I'm like, again, are you serious? How often can this happen? Anyways, I was looking at it and I was there with my um, boyfriend and I was talking to him about it and how it's just never there and there was a lady working um, in the Rimmel section of the chemist warehouse and she was like, oh, are you looking for um, the Maybelline concealer thing I was magis? And I'm like, yeah, I am. And she's like, oh, we just don't put them in because the little containment unit is broken. She's like, do you need me to get some? And I'm like, yes, please. So she got me it and I just, I was going to hug her, but that would have been strange. So yeah, I did finally get it and I'm super excited to try it out. Three more lip colours. I know I got a lot of lip colours. So the first one I got, which I am so excited about. This is one of the Maybelline matte um, lip colours in Lust for Blush. These are new to the drugstore. And oh my god, I have seen these. These have been in America, Canada, and just everywhere besides Australia until this moment. I have wanted this colour since about last year. And it only just came in. And when I saw it, I, I literally just like... <gasps> but oh my gosh, I'm so happy to have this. It's like this really gorgeous kind of purpley, mauve kind of colour. And it's a matte as well, which is just beautiful and Maybelline formulas are beautiful and it smells just beautiful so definitely go pick one of these up. Two more lip products to go. I got a Maybelline Color Drama lip pencil in the color Red Essential. It's just this really nice kind of basic red color. I don't know where I saw it but I saw a swatch of this somewhere and it just looked beautiful. So the formula of these pencils are just out of this world so yeah really beautiful really excited to try that one out the last lip color I got was another Maybelline one I'm sorry I know I'm a little bit crazy about the Maybelline lip products 757 naked brown it's this gorgeous deep reddish purple kind of color this is the color I have on my lips at the moment um, I am doing a video on this makeup look um, using this product and also the Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Liner. My camera just died. Alright guys, so that is all for my haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, give it a thumbs up if you did, and if you'd like to see more of these videos. Make sure to comment any other videos you'd like to see me make. I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! Oh, he's purring. Purring. Sorry, I woke you up. You go back to sleep now.